Hello, 안녕하세요. I'm Terry and welcome to Terry's Home Cooking. Today I'm going to show you how to make jajangmyeon. Jajangmyeon is noodles in black bean sauce. It's a part of Korean Chinese cuisine known as chungha yori. Jajangmyeon used to be eaten on special occasions like birthdays, graduation, or moving day. Now it's more common and eaten on regular days as well. You might have seen this dish a lot in Korean dramas, usually being delivered to their home. It's a very popular delivery food. I'll also show you how to make jajangbap, which uses rice. I'm going to start by chopping the ingredients. All ingredients were cleaned ahead of time. Cut off top and bottom on the cucumber. Then julienne the cucumber using any method. Next, cut the squash into about half an inch planks. Cut those planks into strips. And then chop into cubes. Now, dice the onion. Cut the white part of the scallion in half and finely chop. You can cut the pork however you want. I'm just going to cut into cubes to match the rest. Next, we're going to make the sauce. Turn on the heat to medium-low. Add the oil to the pan and let it heat up. When the oil starts to bubble, add in the scallions and garlic. Stir-fry for a few seconds and add in the pork. Now add the ginger, pepper, and stir fry for another minute. Then put in the rest of the seasonings. Break apart the chunjang and stir fry for 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, add the squash and onions. Stir in well and cook for another 2 to 3 minutes. Add in the water and cook for 5 minutes on medium heat.
stir in between. While that's cooking, we can make the starch water. Add the potato starch to the water and mix well. Pour it onto the sauce. Wait a few seconds and then mix in. The potato starch helps thicken the sauce. Stir fry for about 2 more minutes until the sauce thickens. Turn off the heat and put on the lid. Now we can cook the noodles. Boil some water on high heat. Once it boils, add the noodles. This recipe is for 2 servings. But I'm only cooking one serving today since I'm also making jajangbap. Shake up the noodles before putting them in. Cook according to package instructions. Mine take about 5 minutes. Make sure to stir the noodles often so they don't stick to the bottom. I like to lift the noodles like this. This will make the noodles chewier since it's touching the air. Taste the noodles to make sure they're cooked. Turn off the heat and put into a bowl of cold water. Don't throw out the water we cooked the noodles in yet. Rinse the noodles in cold running water two times. Then squeeze the excess water and place on a strainer. We rinse the noodles in cold water to keep the texture. But since jajangmyeon is a hot dish, I like to put the noodles back into the water we cook them in. Even if the sauce is hot, the cold noodles will make the sauce cold and it won't taste good. Place the noodles back in for about 30 seconds. Then take it out and let the water drain. Put the noodles into a bowl and pour the sauce on top. Add the garnish as well. And your jajangmyeon is done. Looks so yummy. And it doesn't take too long to make. As I said before, you can also make jajangbap, which uses rice instead of noodles. Get some warm rice and pour the sauce on the side. Add the garnishes on top. And now you have jajangbap. Mix well and enjoy. You can always add more sauce if needed. If you want to eat it spicy, you can add gochugaru or Korean red pepper flakes. Jajangmyeon is a huge part of Korean food culture and loved by people of all ages. It has a distinct flavor that keeps people craving it. 
The savory sauce goes so well with both noodles and rice. It's a super, super delicious. Serve with pickled radish, kimchi, onions, and chunjang sauce. Korean people like to add vinegar to the pickled radish and onions. I hope you like this recipe. Thank you so much for watching. If you try this at home, please leave a comment down below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more simple Korean recipes. See you next time guys! Re rinse the noodles in cold running water. <laughs> Re rinse the noodles in. <laughs> this will make the noodles chewier since it's touching the hair. Hair. <laughs> hair. My hair or your hair. Even if the sauce is hot, the cold noodles will make the sauce hot. <laughs> <laughs> then no problem. <laughs>